I'm back. So, today is going to be a little bit different from what I normally do. This is not so much a DIY project, even though I did do it myself. This is more of a, hey, I did this thing video, and I want to show you that if you felt like it, you could do it too. So, I'm going to show you how I forged a hammer. And this is a big reason why. Maker Central in Birmingham, UK is coming up in May of 2019. And were it not for this event, this video that you're about to see would never have happened. I have some more things to say about that toward the end of the video, so watch all of it.
At the beginning of this video, I told you that this whole project wouldn't have happened if I hadn't gone to the Maker Central event. And that's 100% true. There are a lot of people that I know through social media, through YouTube, through Instagram, but I had the opportunity to talk to them face to face at this event. Steve House of Moonshine Metalworks invited us to go down to share his forge and to experience it for the first time. Now, some of us in the group already know what they're doing, blah, 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 but a couple of us did not. And I had the opportunity to make my first blacksmithing project, which was a nail. I mean, I say that kindly because it wasn't really like a very good nail, but it was the first thing that I ever made and I was really proud of it. And because of that experience, I wanted to make my own hammer. Luckily, at this event, I also met Brett of Skull and Spade 13, and he very kindly offered to help me make my first hammer. So I drove from California to New York, and I spent more than a week making this hammer. It was physically and emotionally taxing, but it was so worth it. So thank you to Nick for putting on the Maker Central event. Thank you, Steve, for taking me to the forge. Thank you, Brett, for helping me make the hammer. And Jimmy, thank you for being you. All right, that's all I have to say.